Three ninjas. It's Skull and Crossbones. Wow! We're to adopt me because guess what? We, we adopted a turtle. Rather, the turtle showed up to our house, but we're taking care of it. So we might as well get some practice with some adopt me on Roblox. Is that the sound a turtle makes? I think turtles sound like this. All right, well, we've never played Roblox before, so let's go adopt the- We've never played Roblox. We've, we've never played adopt me before, so let's go adopt the pet. I want a cat. I, I, I think I already got a pet. You Dino Blocks, a buddy of mine, is just riding on my shoulders. What, how did you get that? It's kind of what happens when you're a popular Roblox gamer, Regina. Cash out, ready to adopt a- Fluffy puppy or a cuddly kitten? Oh my gosh. Well, we gotta go to the nursery. Where are you? I'm coming, I'm coming. Can you run in this game? Yeah. WASD. <laughs> well, beyond that. Is this the nursery? No, that's some random guy's house. Oops. Get out! Leave! Don't go into strangers' homes. <laughs> yeah, you really should. There you are. About time. Melvin, can I give you a free item? Someone wants to give you a free item. Yes, Birdie. If anybody's been paying attention, uh, Birdie's been a part of my past couple videos. What the heck is a Birdie? He looks like a little lizard boy. Yeah, that's what he is. Free items because of clout and swagger. Except, <laughs> it's this trade fair they're asking. <laughs> I guess I already have a pet. You have a pet? Birdie is your pet? I'm gonna get the spine and just caught up with what's happening. In the last video, Chad's secret admirer left behind an obstacle course board game in our backyard. Can you believe Chad has a secret admirer? Yes. Uh, yes, Regina, I can believe it. I am shocked a little bit. Uh, I mean, Chad's a taken man. He, he's got a husband, no, wife. No. He's got a wife. Yeah, but I'm sure we all have admirers. We're kind of pretty big on YouTube these days, Regina. I know. But did you see V's reaction to all the hubba bubba? Yes, I have. It's it's not good. It's a little <laughs> spicy. What made it even worse was last week, every day we would receive a random gift in the mail. Sounds familiar, right? Like Allie when she was still Daniel Stalker. It's a little too familiar where I'm like creeped out by Chad's secret admirer. Yeah. Gonna be another stalker. Yes, but admirer seems a little bit nicer. At the beginning of the week, Chad's secret admirer left us a turtle. Turtle! Um. From what I know, you either talk to Doug. Doug? Doug? Douglas? Daniel's Daniel dog? Yeah, his long lost bull terrier French. What is it? French bulldog. Oh, yeah. Come on with all the little wrinkles. And he goes. Do you remember, do you remember, do you remember the puppet version of Douglas and how Allie set it on fire? Yo! Yo! That's messed up. Gosh, yeah, this is crazy. We're all over the place today, folks. That happened. Yeah, it turns out Allie stole Daniel's dog. Remember that footage we saw a long time ago of a girl walking away with Douglas? It was Allie this whole time. Crazy. That was like two years ago. She's planning something big, or she's already part of something big. <laughs> Regina, you have a starter egg on you. What do I do with it? Do you want a cat or a dog? Talk to Doug if you want to get a duh, dog. Where's that dog? And then Holly if you want a cat, I think. Oh, oh. I'm gonna get a cat, which is how it be. You would. Cats, 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 I love cats. Want a cat? Of course you would. I love cats. Let's get that egg hatched. Let's hatch this eggy. How do I feed this unhatched egg? Oh! I have no food! Can you give me food? I can't help you! My stingray said it's feeling sick! I gotta go to the hospital! Yeah, and how are you supposed to take care of a turtle if you can't take care of a virtual stingray? Hungry. Your baby is hungry. Grandma's gonna eat. I'm trying, bro. Your baby's gonna die! Don't say that! I love my unhatched eggy. Hospital rooms are on the left. Okay. Okay. There you go. Stingray is getting operated on. <laughs> okay. Where were we? Oh, when 
Allie left that burning Douglas puppet. I'm so glad you and V went to go chase after her. You guys got her arrested? Me and V went on an awesome girl mission, just us two, and we we defeated Allie and Malik. They were being real bullies this week, and they're in prison now. That is so crazy. And that's what happens when you mess with the Spy Ninja fam. Wow, ladies of the Spy Ninjas. And do you know what happened after you guys left? Buy chocolate milk. Bye. <gasps> no, we didn't buy chocolate milk. I'm lactose intolerant. Oh, what happened when you left? Chad, Daniel, and I had to learn how to take care. What's happening? I fed my eggy oh, milk. milk. Is it hasn't even hatched yet. I know, I need to feed it more. And my unhatched egg is eating some apples. Can I put my seahorse? I <laughs> put my babies in a stroller. Chad, Daniel, and I had to learn how to take care of a turtle. How was that? When I was on the phone with you guys, y'all seemed a little unsure about what you were doing, and I was getting really worried about the well-being of Mr. Turtle. That is what my name is for him right now, Mr. Turtle. It would be so simple. It's a nice name. Like, you just put Mr. in front of the name of the object. <laughs> wow, you're so original. Mr. Maybe you can try a little better. Well, we haven't even come up with a name for it, so I guess that's Star. Mr. Turtle. Do you have any better ideas for names for this little turtle boy? Oh my gosh, my egg feels sick! Take it to the hospital! Where's the hospital? Well, recently, this name just keeps coming up in my head that I really want to name it. I don't know if all the spy ninjas would want the name. What is the name? I want to call the turtle Flukas. <laughs> I really do! Flukas! Oh! to it. You gotta help me out. On Chad and V's channel, you gotta just comment down below you want the turtle to be named Flukas. F-L-U-K-A-S. Please. That's the only way Chad and V will let me name it Flukas. Well, with all that adventure, I learned so much about turtles. Um, I also lost him, Bruh. but then Daniel no, got I the habitat. It. I knew it, you lost him. Yeah, we got him back, safe and sound, and Daniel got a nice aquatic habitat. It was over $300, bro. Wow, that's a lot of money. Oh no, wait, I have a cat. Oh, wow, wow. meow. <laughs> he's gray and he's got little black whiskers and pink ears and a pink nose. I'm gonna name him. Mr. Newborn. <laughs> no. I think I'm gonna name him Jeffrey. Yeah. Ah! Sorry, I'm stuck. So what, what else happened with this turtle adventure of yours with Chad and Daniel? Well, we're pretty much good now and he's been chilling in an awesome place. I just bought decorations for it. Can't wait to show you guys in the next video. Or maybe at the end of this video, <gasps> I'll show you how our turtle, AKA Flukas, Lucas. AKA Mr. Mr. Turtle, turtle. Is, is doing. I wonder what his talents are or how well he'd do in a battle royale. We can swag him out with some Spy Ninja merch. Imagine him with a little... With a... I don't know. A little something. A little something. <laughs> yeah, as long as it's ethical and safe for the turtle. So, what else happened? Well, along with Flukas, Chad's mystery admirer had also gifted us a whole bunch of things that we all opened up yesterday during that obstacle course board game challenge. I mean, we just got a whole bunch of crazy swag. Yeah, what was that about? We got a squid. Go, what do you remember? We got a squid squishy. Yeah. We got elf ears. Yeah. We got... A red button, a bunch of rats, a little glass ball thingy that burned my hand really bad. That's crazy. Ew. The power of sunlight and stuff. Um... I'm not gonna let you guys forget. After this video, tell Chad and V we gotta name the turtle Flukas, please! It's like so unique! It's a great name, but if you guys have any of your own ideas too, comment them down below. We'd love to hear your ideas. But I want Flukas. But Melvin wants Flukas. You can comment down below all you want, but... Flukas. PZ Niners will want Flukas. <laughs> There's one more. I don't remember. Maybe you spy and just know. Maybe you guys have already decoded it. If you guys have decoded it, comment down below and let us know. Yeah. Who do you think Chad's secret admirer is? Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. All right, it's time to shower, Jeffrey. Scrubby scrub scrub. 
Cats actually hate showers. How do they get clean? They lick themselves. Oh, that doesn't sound sanitary. They groom themselves. It's very nice. What else happened this week? So I'm oh. trying to bathe my stingray. Okay. Oh, and the craziest thing happened. You know how we got Allie and the leak arrested? Yeah. Well, before that, I actually had no idea they were full on evil. I mean, something happened where all of a sudden they just got crazy. Yeah, literally, like we invited Allie over to tell us about Agent Peters, her brother, who's trying to start Project Zorgo again. Yeah. He's trying to make a Project Zorgo? They're dead. Good luck. There's no way he's going to be able to do that. Not as long as the spinaches are around. Exactly. I mean, what is up with Chef Crouton, Agent Peters? Why does he even want to do this? He must be planning something huge, but we're not going to let him get away with it because we already got Allie and Malik arrested. And they were messing real hard with us yesterday at the safe house. The leak was hiding in our vents, playing pranks on us. Yeah, stink bombs, Ugh. fires in the bathroom. It's dangerous stuff, really. What's wrong with your friend, the leak? He's not my friend anymore. We haven't been friends in a long time. And besides the two of them, we know for a fact that Agent Peters slash Chef Crouton slash Leader Peters is also super evil. But thankfully, we put an end to his events. He was trying to hire people using Roblox to join his cause for this Project Zorgo 2.0 or whatever. He's been scamming people on Roblox. So guys, be careful when you're playing. You never know when Agent Peters is going to come up to you and be like, hey. Wanna be a bully hacker for me? Yeah, don't accept random friend requests from people you don't know or, you know, have played a little bit with. Yeah. Is your baby thirsty? It's still showering, right? Oh, you could just get out. Oh, really? Oh, I'm holding my little kitty. See, Melvin, you lost the turtle, you lose your stingray. Are you ready to be a pet owner? <laughs> oh my gosh! B Swarm Simulator? Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh, oh, flashbacks! <laughs> oh, oh. Triggered! Ah. Get away from there! I'm just gonna play B Swarm right now! No, 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 get away! No. Look, look, you can tame a wild bee with honey! Which is actually backwards. Oh my gosh, Regina. Throughout all the time we were dealing with Allie and Leader Peters, do you realize how much bullying is going on in this world? It breaks my heart! It really does. People are just so mean. Oh, ask pet trainer to teach your pet new tricks? Yes. Easy job, mate. I'm the best animal handler there is. Step back and whoop. I'm losing. I don't have a good accent. It's, it's an accent of some step. sort. Is it Melbourne? I step back and watch this. <laughs> You're about to see some magic. Ready? Melbourne. Joyful. <laughs> Just kidding. Should be alright. That was pra- Oh, forget it. Quickly. Oh. I have those flies around my cat! Jeffrey! It's dirty! It's dirty! I'm so sorry, baby. Oh! Oh, my stingray knows how to sit! Isn't it already constantly? <laughs> how is it sitting? How do stingrays sit? Like, they like, like bend their bodies. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, spy ninjas, if you've ever been bullied, let me know down in the comments. Because sometimes it happens to people and sometimes it doesn't and sometimes you're the bully. But it's just, first off, it's not good to bully people. Mm -hmm. Whatever kind of stresses and situations that you're finding in your life that get you angry and push you to bully others, well, it's not right. Because you're just handing all that frustration over to somebody else. And you're never truly getting over that frustration or difficulty in your life. And can you imagine getting bullied or if you have been bullied how that follows you for the rest of your life and some people are never able to get over their bullies it's just terrible it is always remember your words and your actions really do affect people so it's always good to be nice to others if you're getting if you're getting bullied speak out tell your friend tell your teacher or if you feel like you have enough power and strength tell your bully let them know how you feel about it Okay? And if the bully doesn't respect that, well, don't give respect to your bully. And if you're getting bullied for whatever reason, always remember, it's not your fault. Whatever it is that you like, like Pokemon, it's cool. If you guys at home get bullied for something you like, whether it's Pokemon, Fortnite, Roblox, or even loving the Spy Ninjas, 
Don't let that stop you. Mm -hmm. It's people bully for all sorts of reasons, and maybe they just don't understand why you you love something. But it doesn't mean you shouldn't stop liking the things you do. Yeah. Because somebody bullies you for it. And it doesn't make you uncool or cringy or anything. It just makes you you, and. Whoever you are, you are amazing, awesome, probably really funny. <laughs> yeah. Just like a great spy ninja like us. Oh, check this out though. I want to see this stroll. Are we playing this game correctly? I don't think so. My pet is just like getting sick, doing all this stuff, and sleeping. It's not even waking up. Feed. Guys at home, I've heard that some spy ninjas have been bullied for wearing merch. And that's not cool. That makes me so angry. It really does. We wear our merch all the time, loudly and proudly. I'm wearing V's merch right here. Pink looks pretty good on me. It looks great on you. Thanks, sis bro. You're welcome, sis bro. Just know that being a spy ninja means you're a part of something huge, where you and millions of other spy ninjas and us can get together for just a couple minutes out of your day to explore crazy adventures, to solve mysteries, to celebrate friendship, and to defeat evil. And you're part of one of the biggest families in the world. Spy Ninja family. Yeah, and that's more important than what your bully thinks of you. And if you're ever feeling alone, just remember, you got me, Melvin, Chad, B, and Daniel on your side. Just like earlier in the week. Oh yeah, the fans. We met some fans. They were just walking around in the park, having a good old time. And then these hacker bullies go up to them and steal their merch and they start bullying them. I, I hope you guys at home aren't being attacked by any kind of weird hacker members or new PZ people or whatever sent by Agent Peters or Leader Peters. Yeah. Thankfully, they're all close by and we were able to do something about it. And we gave them all that free merch. <laughs> Third time's a charm. Daniel's video tomorrow. When I read through the comments, I want to see Flukas as the top comment. Uh, speaking of Flukas, well, maybe we should show him again. Yeah. In, in the habitat I got for him. I want to show all of the P9 fans Flukas. Yeah, just in case they missed it, which you shouldn't. Hey, if you are missing out on videos, that means you're not subscribed to everybody. And it only seems like 42% of you guys are actually subscribed to my channel. Why don't we put us up in like the 90s, bro? And hit that subscribe button! Hit it, Regina! Yeah, yeah. Hit the button! Hit it! Hit it. Hit it. Yeah! Woo Let's go see Flukas. Okay! Introducing the updated uh, tank for our turtle! Daniel got the tank, but I am the interior decorator of the space. <laughs> Mr. Or turtle loves his new home! No, it's not Mr. Turtle! It's Flukus! Let me show you guys Flukus! I don't like the Flukus. name Flukus! I was thinking we name him Douglas, too. No! <laughs> Why, so somebody can light him on fire? Hi, Shelly! Why Shelly? Because he's a he has a shell. See, Regina. That's, that's like naming a cat uh, meow. <laughs> <laughs> it's Lucas. It's Lucas. Oh. You guys don't like Lucas? Team Lucas. Chad, where do you get Lucas from? You probably it sounds already. like mucus. Yeah. yeah. And when you have phlegm and mucus is. Flukus. Yeah. Excuse, excuse me, I got Flukus. Or when you're sick and then you smooch somebody. A Flukus. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh. I'm liking it less and less. What's wrong? He's so active today. You should have seen when Chad, Daniel, and I had to take care of him for the first day. He was not moving. Now this guy just can't stop. Whoa! Look at that. He's a fast <laughs> turtle. <laughs> Melvin, turn <laughs> Oh my god. Run, buddy, run. You Swim go. Wee. Wow. Hi. <laughs> Don't let Melvin influence you with his idea for names. I want to see what the spy ninjas come up with. Something original, something new, not that Flukas. Flukas is original. I never I, heard that I, word before. I made okay, it. Okay, it's original. It's original. Oh, yeah, 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 it is. But I want to hear their original ideas. Yeah. Comment down below. Mm -hmm. Anything you guys want, we'll name it. That. All right, Spy Ninjas. Well, thanks a lot for tuning in on today's gaming channel. Toot toot. Well, since we have all the Spy Ninjas here, why don't we go for a good old fashioned kickball?